Hello, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. Stressed out 72 here. Well, had an issue um, with uh, the plate down here. And um, so what happened was, is I was heating it up just to see how hot I could get it. It was somewhere around 1200 degrees at the top of the barrel here. And um, the quarter inch uh, steel, which is just mild steel, 4130 probably, it popped up on that side over there. So um, quarter inch steel, I mean that thing, you know, that's, that's pretty thick. And uh, it was a pretty, pretty big plate, you know, almost, what was it, three foot by two foot, you know, with the hole in there. So I took it out. I'm just going to try something. Um, I do have another uh, flue or uh, exhaust pipe here uh, in concrete and a vermiculite. Same thing I got here. It's only going to be about maybe 10 to 12 inches tall. And then... Um, because I just don't want to have to carry this big old heavy thing in concrete, you know. It's like three inches on either side here that you have to have it, you know, in order for it not to crack. So I'm just going to only going to make it about, oh, maybe a foot. And then on top of that, I'll place this thing so that I got something to, you know, go flat down against. Anyways, that's my, that's my next little uh, theory. We'll see how it works um, until this inner core of this thing burns out of here so uh, you know this 8 inch pipe here because this is a galvanized piece I was going to go with the 8 inch uh, stainless single wall um, uh, I probably have to get a double wall though because I don't think they make a single wall so everything is okay down in there you know at the bottom um, so I took and uh, put the high temperature silicone it's uh, the thousand degree silicone on the 8 inch pipe um, around the tabs and up underneath the tabs and then I just kind of squeezed it down on that and then I got just some regular brick I know you're gonna say oh well that only you know can take so much temperature I really don't care the point was just to hold the tabs down and I kind of placed them uh, this way yeah so I placed them like that okay on top of the tabs all the way around and then this 14 inch pipe fit nice and snug down here at the bottom where those bricks are. And then of course I packed my vermiculite, the dry vermiculite back in there all the way down. And um, I did the same thing. Here's some of that silicone, uh, the high temperature silicone pooching out of here, which is fine. Um, it sticks really good to the concrete. So hopefully it'll hold it in place. Um, I'm not gonna light it again today. I covered this guy um, because I have to make a new little uh, deal separately just for this. I might just make that, cut that out and just put it back on there, that metal, and then I can put my glass back in there. It really doesn't matter. I, I, I know what it's doing now and it looks really good so I can even seal it, leave it alone, whatever. It doesn't matter. Um, so now what I'll do is I'll go ahead and put my drum back on here sitting over here okay there's my drum I am gonna have to raise this up probably that quarter inch which is no big deal um, let me show you the silicone this is the super high temp stuff thousand degree stuff ICS industries or IGS sorry that's a G yeah IGS industries mill pack black okay Osbis high performance direct vent sealant. So this stuff is the black stuff and it's a thousand. I also am using this stuff from Imperial Silicone, okay, and it gets up to uh, It says 400 degrees right here So this one's a thousand this one's 400. I'll put the 400 on the outside of the bottom of the drum just to seal it down because I don't have, I can't use my bolts anymore to hold that thing down, so I'll just seal it down to the to, to the concrete. And I actually got this pretty pretty flat across here. So before I even started this whole thing, um, so we'll just set it down, bolt it all together. Tomorrow we'll go ahead and do another uh, test uh, run, 
and we'll see, you know, if we can keep it up there in the 800 degree range, uh, sustain it for maybe an hour or something like that. Maybe two hours. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Well, thanks for watching.